Let's take a look on how to get the mouse press event in Pygame. So, after this if statement, I'm going to create a new check for the mouse press event. And I'm going to ask if event the type equals Pygame, Pygame dot mouse button down. So this checks whether uh, mouse button is down. So if I give here print, I'm just going to print click, click. And if I run the application, and when I click with the left mouse button or with the right or with the middle, it just prints click. So whatever button I'm pressing, it will just print the click. So I need here one more uh, if statement, which will check which button, mouse button is pressed. So inside uh, the body of this if, the if statement, I'm going to create a new if statement, which will be the if by game that mouse that get pressed get pressed and uh, but first of all let's just uh, pass and print out the, this uh, pygame that mouse that get pressed so print and I'm just going to quickly copy and paste it here so that you will see that it returns a tuple so now I'm clicking with the left button and it returns a tuple with three numbers and the left most number is one, which means I clicked with the left button. If I click with the middle button, now the middle number is one. And if I click with the right button, it uh, the right uh, number is one. So, okay, now we can close the application. I'm going to delete this um, print and I'm going to ask if pygame that mouse that get pressed and here index zero, so the left mouse button. So here, so if this will evaluate to 1. So if 1, then execute the next uh, code. So in that, um, in that case, I'm going to create a position variable and, uh, and I'm going to store into this position variable where on the screen I was clicked. So or I clicked with the button. So pygame dot mouse dot get position dot get underscore position and let me print this position and let me run the application and now when I click with the left mouse button it just shows the position where I clicked. So here should be the zero zero uh, and here should be the 600, 600. And also now that I here, as I asking only for the left mouse button, this code executes only when the left mouse button is pressed. So if I press the right, nothing happens, or if I press the middle button, nothing happens. Just with the left, it only prints the position variable. The next thing I need to do is actually convert these screen coordinates into cell coordinates. So let's say if I click on the first cell, I just want to get value 0 and 0. If I click on the second cell, I want to get the value 1, 0. 
And if I click on the third cell in the first row, I want to get 2 and 0. So here will be the 0, 1, 1, 1, and 2, 1. And this last cell will be the 2, 2 cell. So to convert these screen coordinates, into cell coordinates i'm just going to print it out so first i'm going to this position returns a tuple of two values which is x and y coordinates and i'm going to get the first index from this tuple and using integer division divide it by 200 and then i'm going to print out the uh, white uh, position and also divide it with in integer division by 200 and let me run it and now when I click on the first cell it just prints 0 0 and uh, it, it does not matter where I click inside this cell it always just uh, prints out the zero zero. The second cell will print out one zero. So no matter where I click in this cell, it just prints out one zero. And the first cell will print, print out two and zero. And also this cell is the two two. And this middle cell is the one one. One one. So this is a nice way how to get the screen coordinates into this cell coordinates. And uh, the next thing why I am dividing it by 200 is because each of these cells is a 200 by 200 rectangle. So if you are using uh, another size, let's say you are using 400 by 400, then make sure that you are using here also 400 by 400 and also make sure to use integer division, not a floating point division.